There are five huge reasons why people fail in recruiting in network marketing. 1. The distributor not talking to people. Yes, you read that right. Amazing as that sounds. There are many people who lead people to believe with their words that they are actually recruiting and talking to people. But they are not. They are busy at building a facade of a business and never really engaging the conversation and contact necessary for success. Why? Fear of many things. But that is the biggest reason. And how do you overcome it? Find a recruiting partner who will help emotionally support you and help you, whether it is your upline or sideline. And work with them. Yes, there are folks out there who truly are talking to no one, as they are scared. If you see no action happening with someone in your downline, it may be a silent talker. Otherwise someone who talks about recruiting, but is silent when it comes time to recruit. You must communicate with folks if you are going to have success in the marketplace and with your home business. 2. The distributor not talking to enough people. This is an interesting thing. There seems to be a comfort level with people that says, I have talked to XX number of people, and nothing is happening, so that means I can't recruit because this doesn't work. Again, not. One of the biggest reasons failure occurs in MLM is, too many distributors spend too much time, with too many people, who have too little of an interest. Talk to a lot of different people, and it's all because they don't have to go out and talk to new people. They would tather talk to people with little interest than new folks who do have an interest. In MLM recruiting, new blood keeps the heart of your business pumping. Talk to enough people and talk to people enough, but don't turn them off. 3. The distributor not talking to the right people. Wasting massive amounts of time. That is what most distributors do when recruiting and continue to do. They talk to the wrong people, and then bring in the wrong people, and then have a downline of mostly wrong people. Who are the right people? People who light up and catch fire when you show them your home business, and then light others up when they talk. Not someone who complains after only two days because the application is the wrong color. To attract the right one for your home business success, you must become the right one. You must become who you want to attract into this home business through personal development and empowerment. 4. The distributor not talking right to people. This is a business of communication, and thus of verbiage and emotion as well. A lot of distributors are simply saying the wrong things to the wrong people with the wrong message. You must talk to people with a you focus. It is called the TINY focus, their interests not yours. And you focus whether online or offline, on what interests them and do it professionally. Nothing turns someone off worse than a self-focused and self-absorbed direct sales distributor who is only focused on recruiting a person for their reasons. Not the reason of the prospect. And the words they are using reveal a lot. Me. Me. I. I. Me. Me. I. I. Me. 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 Dot you. You should say the word, you, at least four times more than the word, I, or, me, in any home business presentation. 5. Talking too much to people you are talking to. Some folks have diarrhea of the mouth. And they talk, and talk, and they talk, and then talk. And talk, and talk, and by the time they finish, the prospect's finished. Don't dump on people. Create a recruiting environment. That creates the prospect to do most of the talking. Ask a lot of questions. Listen a lot of minutes. Ask a lot of questions. Most people love to have an audience. But they hate to be an audience. You be an audience of one for massive listening to your prospect, and don't create a sat chat. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your team members. Also, to get the future video updates don't forget to subscribe my channel and turn on the bell icon.